The home of the Californiacs was the first state park state. Back in 1865, the federal government gave her the Yosemite Valley, which was a state park until it went back to Uncle Sam again in 1890 to become part of Yosemite National Park. At the turn of the century, she made a second effort, buying 9,000 acres of redwood forest and creating California Redwood State Park. Redwoods, the tall, tapering giants of the tree world, are largely responsible for the fact that the Golden State has a state park system, one of the finest in existence. During the World War, an extraordinary organization the Save the Redwoods League was brought into existence chiefly to save as much as possible of the virgin redwood forest along the northern coast of the state. Out of the work of this league grew the movement for a series of parks to contain liberal samples of the best of California's natural beauty. Three to one, Californians voted in 1929 in favor of a bond issue of six million dollars for parks. The Bond Act required that if that six million dollars has been spent. And for it, California has obtained mountain and sea, forest and desert, canyon, stream and waterfall worth twice majestic world, carpeted with smooth oxalis or giant fern, from which great clean trunks rise 300 feet toward the sky, are found in California's state parks, saved forever from the ax, to fill those who behold them with awe and reverence.